Hey everybody, this is a root guide on for your Droid Bionic. First I'll show you that it's not rooted. There you can see it's not. There is no super user app. So the first thing you're going to do is on your computer, download either the 32 or 64 bit version of the Motorola drivers for your phone. Then download this file, which was released by a dude over on XDA. It's wonderful. Give him thanks if you ever see him. Huh. Um, once that's downloaded, go ahead and extract it somewhere. I've already extracted it here in my downloads folder. Uh, install the Motorola drivers. And once you get those installed on your phone, you're going to want to go to Settings, Applications, Development. Ensure that USB debugging is checked. At that point, you will want to plug in your phone. Mine's already plugged in. If yours isn't, plug it in now. And change the USB connection to charge only. Okay. Open up that folder where you had that, where you just extracted your files to. Right click the batch file without the mine at the end of it. Right click it and do run as administrator. Now you're going to get all these options. What we want to do is just root and forever root the non-rooted bionic so press 2 and we have already done all of that All right, now that 30 seconds is up, you can press any key on the keyboard. It's pushing all the root files that we need. Success. It says we now should be forever rooted. Yay. Press any key, and you're all done. Go back to your Bionic. You can now see we have the super user app. All right, um, we've got SQLite. Oh, just it didn't reload. Uh, Wi-Fi tether. Let's try that. Granted super user permissions, and it starts up successfully. There we go. All right, thank you for watching. If you ever need to unroot your phone. I've got a video on how to do that too. Thanks.